Hey everybody, it's Mike from Roberts Innovations. This here is a Yeti. And the number one complaint that I found online for this particular model is that it doesn't fit in a cup holder. It absolutely doesn't. So, what we're going to do is we're going to build an insert that will go into this section of the cup holder and be able to put this in it to make sure that it's nice and secure. Because the last thing that I want is my wife to get burned during driving. So, go ahead and finish watching this video and we'll move forward. Let's go. The first thing that I did was measure the cup holder, transferred the dimensions onto my piece of wood that I was going to use, and cut it out on my miter saw. I used a jig to find the exact shape and traced it onto my piece. Using a belt sander, I sanded to my line. It was still a little too long, so I cut it to its final dimension. I used a piece of green tape to make sure I had a really nice, clean line. Traced around for the bottom piece, and cut it out on the bandsaw. I had this rubber bottom that I used, and stuck it to it. Okay, so on the bottom of the Yeti, it's rounded in here and so when I put it on the piece of wood and traced around I got a smaller hole than what I needed uh, to be able to fit this whole thing in there um, so I've erased my marks here and what I found is that this and this is perfect size for it so I've got the cap here, and this fits perfectly inside. So I'm going to actually match this, not this. I used green tape and super glue to secure it to some rails. As you can see in the lower corner, I had a problem with a bunch of clamps in my jigsaw. It caused it to jump up like that. So that's why I used the CA glue and the tape. There we go. Nothing obstructing it, so I could use my jigsaw and cut out the circle. I used a file to sand it to its final shape. Here's me applying that rubber bottom and applying some finish. I did two coats of lacquer. I sanded with 220 in between the coats. I hope you found this really helpful. If this helped you at all, or if you know anybody with this issue, make sure to share and tag them in this video so that way they can benefit from it as well. If you have any comments, please feel free to leave them below. I try to answer those to the best of my ability and we'll catch you on the next one.